It's at it again. President Obama is preparing to ask Congress to raise the debt ceiling. According to Treasury Department officials, the Obama administration wants to increase America's borrowing limit by a mere $1.2 trillion, therefore raising the national debt limit to a staggering $16.4 trillion. And for those of you wondering, yes, this is the same guy who chastised George W. Bush for raising the national debt back in 2008. The way Bush has done it over the last eight years is to take out a credit card from the Bank of China in the name of our children, driving up our national debt from $5 trillion for the first 42 presidents. Number 43 added $4 trillion by his lonesome, so that we now have over $9 trillion of debt that, that we are going to have to pay back. $30,000 for every man, woman, and child. That's irresponsible. It's unpatriotic. I think it's now 50 grand per child, which is incredibly patriotic. We need the extra large abacus uh, for this. Bush uh, raised it by $4 trillion over eight years. That's irresponsible. Obama has raised it by $6 trillion over three years. That's incredibly uh, responsible. And this increase will take place automatically unless lawmakers reject it by January the 14th. And, by happy coincidence, Congress will still be in recess at that time. How clever of the White House. Joining me now with reaction uh, from the Fox Business Network, Charles Payne, and the executive...